Hi all, welcome back. Um, time for another pour. Today uh, I have not added silicone to my paints. In this cup there is titanium white. Um, God, there's yellow, primary yellow. Um, green, permanent green, I think. Violet Caped Mortem, which is a violet reddish color. Um, and two shades of blue. One dark, um, the Prussian blue Thalo, and a mid to light blue, the manganese blue. Um, so yeah, no silicone added. So I'm going to see if I can make cells by dipping my little barbecue skewer in some silicone um, to make cells where I want them to be. Little experiment. Here it goes. So it just got some fluff stuck to my gloves. Don't want that in the painting. You see, even though there's no silicone anywhere near this painting yet, there are a few cells popping up on their own. Just clean my hands a bit. Okay, here goes. I'm going to try and make some like flower-like shapes. I don't know how it will work, but ah, there's a fluff stuck to the skewer. Uh -huh. I don't know where I'm getting these fluffy bits from. Let's see if I can find another skewer.
Okay, this seems to be working out okay. Um, hmm, pattern planning. Not my strength. First time I try to kind of create these gloom like cell formations by hand. I'm really loving the colours in this one, so I'm gonna see if I can make another one close to that one and have similar um, color combination. Sorry I'm leaning all the way into the canvas right now. It's just to steady my hands when I when I'm poking the canvas. So I will obscure the view for a bit. But hopefully you'll hang in there. Bear with me. See what happens if I add one up here that hides under the dark blue. Okay, there's some manganese blue under there. reaching the point where I have to consider adding some more or stopping. But I'm shit at restraining myself anyway, so I'll just keep going. Okay, I'm thinking one more down here and then I'll stop. Leave some of the area in the middle Some of these flowers are turning out quite pretty, aren't they? Um, I 
actually I think I'm I'm going to add just a few because that cell feels a bit lonely on its own so I'm going to add two or three in the middle there not kind of full flower like shapes but just some cells to I don't know just make some movement in here Sorry, I just started whispering. Don't know why I do that. Probably because I'm concentrating. Um, oh yeah. I like where this is heading. And definitely has potential for uh, evolving into something more. I love how the Prussian blue thalo the Caped Morton Violet Red and the Yellow are blending together here. There's kind of different things happening with each flower. It's quite cool, isn't it? <laughs> okay, so I'm going to leave this for a few minutes just to um, develop a bit further. Uh, let the paint sink a bit, uh, blend or move through each other, see if anything more happens and then I'll come back and tilt and stretch and move them and make them a bit bigger. Okay, so I'll see you in a few minutes. Okay, I'm back. I actually ended up leaving them for about 10 minutes, uh, a little bit longer than I planned. Um, so the yellow have has come up uh, through those additional cells I added, which I think looks quite good. Um, let's see if I can stretch them without completely ruining the shapes. Another reason to do this stretching part, uh, in addition to expanding the cells and make them bigger, is that it also helps uh, the layers of paint blend and uh, shine through. Those three blooms first away from me right now I know a bit too green. Hopefully, um, some stretching can make them uh, make the other colors shine through the green. Don't remember the opacity of the green paint. Um, I think it's toward the opaque end of the scale, though not completely opaque. Um, actually, I think this is looking quite good. I think I'm going to leave it. If I if I keep tilting now, I'm just going to ruin the shape of the pretty little flowers that I've made. Clean my hands, clean the edges, and then I'll take you down for a close up. So, what do you think about this technique, this style? Should I, should I do more of it? I think probably I will. Quite like it. It's nice to do. 
something different from time to time.